humans for as long as we've been doing cultivated plants, been moving plants around as we move around. So often what it's have been happening is we are moving to a new climate. We try to breed our plants in order to do well in that new climate. For the last couple of years, we've been doing a lot of research on uh, trying to understand dormancy and the ability of plants to come through winter and count the amount of cold they get in order to break bud in the spring. So this is a, something that we call chilling requirement. A lot of temperate tree species do this. It's a really important one in this part of the world because of the peach crop. And so we've been doing a lot of work trying to understand what is the basis, the genetic basis of how these uh, buds actually sense the cold and give us tools to try to manipulate or adapt the trees to an, the particular environment we have here in South Carolina. And we will be the first people really in any tree model system uh, to really be able to go down from a population that we have in the field and go all the way down to see what specific genes in the genome might be responsible for the trait. And then we'll go back to do testing. It's really us being able to adapt to a changing climate instead of trying to adapt our plants to a different climate as we move them around, which is what we've done for a very long time. We know there's going to be some kind of change. We're not really sure exactly what and how much, but are we ready to change with it when it happens? So it's, it's really about being secure and being ready to adapt to the change when it, when it comes.